Uh, hello, hello, my friends. Nice to see you uh, tonight. Um, uh, I am very happy that you joined today to the workshop. I hope you hear me and see me. Please uh, write to the chat. Uh, everything is okay or not today with connection. Okay. I just ask my technical support. Everything is okay. <laughs> okay, so I will read your comments first. I see from Yolanda. Hello all. Hello Yolanda. I'm really happy to see you today. Uh, Martina. Uh, hello, <laughs> uh, hello Martina, Ruby, also I see your uh, comment, hello, nice to see you today, uh, Jamie, hello, uh, Yolanda Martin, hi, <laughs> Pam Everett, hi everyone, hello, uh, so nice to see you today, and uh, we have some news, we will start from results, next I will tell you a few words, just write to the chat, do you hear me and see me, all is okay, I see from Martina, great, uh, so now I know that you hear me, <laughs> we can start. Yolanda Martin also, I see and hear you, thanks. I am very happy. Today everything works uh, also great. Uh, hi Julia, all is well. Uh, I am very happy. <laughs> so we can start. Uh, first results. And I will show you first result. Sorry, <laughs> but... <laughs> okay, now I have some troubles with this. Uh, okay, I have a result. First result from Yolanda. Uh, so, uh, you made elements that I showed you in previous, all, uh, all, okay, here from Ruby, thank you Ruby. Okay, technical support also told me everything is great. Uh, so we have a uh, motif indie, uh, we talked about this motif last time, and uh, it's a really interesting motif. Yolanda, thank you so much that you tried to make it, uh, your result, like always, is great. Uh, this mot motif is not so easy to make, um, uh, everything depends from the distance between long parts, and uh, you made it very good. Uh, and this grid uh, is really nice here, we can see. So. Uh, what I can say, uh, it's very nice that you try to make different elements. Uh, sometimes you think maybe this element is too easy or too hard, but when you try just make different elements, you will have uh, just um, enough skills uh, to to make uh, even uh, difficult motifs because you just will know uh, how to make different parts. So it's really great that all the time you try to make different elements and you show me and show us your results. Uh, this uh, this is really important. Uh, just to uh, yes achieve good results in future so thank you so much for this work uh, next result uh, this was first uh, first homework uh, in my cr crochet course about dress Amelie uh, this motifs was made by Monica uh, Monica I hope you will see this workshop uh, so we have here a very uh, beautiful accurate work perfect elements as uh, from such elements I am sure uh, Monica will create incredible lace especially uh, she is using uh, original threads so it's my favorite viscose and even colors are the same we have here cream colored thread and uh, this all motifs uh, we have from cream colored thread uh, sapphire looks uh, we have Daphna we have Dion also just part uh, of Dion with one tweak with two tweaks uh, like this motifs we will use so perfect result thank you so much also we have another motifs made by Monica as uh, the first homework and uh, the second I think we have uh, here elements uh, all these elements we used for a uh, top and middle part of dress we create lace from different uh, outer elements so we have at the left side flower with wings and uh, at this side, at the right side, big flower talisman in two colors, golden beige and cream colored thread, and also very small flower talisman, uh, flower uh, with three petals, and a very small leaf terry that we will use also for our composition. So like this, incredible results. I am very happy to see and I am very grateful for your work. Monica, thank you so much. And together we will create such beautiful uh, evening dress for you. It will be nice. Uh, from Yolanda Sainz. I see hello ladies from uh, Linda. Linda, I'm very happy to see you. Hello. So, uh, 
So we just start from results. Next few news I have for you. Uh, so like this. And now uh, next. Uh, we have incredible results. Yes, because each time when I see um, ready projects is fantastic. We have here even more. We have dress created by. Uh, this is design made by Yolanta Madsen. Uh, just. Uh, this uh, everything is so incredible because design created by Yolanta Madsen. This all motifs that we have here, almost all we learn it in our workshops. So step by step, Yolanta created one motif, second motif, third, and now we can see how she joined together all these elements. And uh, this is just fantastic for me. Thank you so much from all my heart uh, because it's uh, so nice that all these workshops you journeyed and created a really beautiful. Dress. And maybe uh, soon we will see another your project. This will be a surprise. We will just hold the secret for next time. And uh, what I can say about this dress? Uh, fantastic color. Uh, composition is very nice. Design is very beautiful. Uh, also, all your work is accurate and fantastic. Uh, thank you so much that you shared these results with us. Each dress is just a big project and uh, it's special because someone will wear this dress and uh, receive a lot of positive emotions. So this all hard work uh, will bring a lot of uh, emotions to another person, yes. Or just Yolanta can create for herself something and just feel amazing emotions and a lot of compliments you can receive. Uh, so I just am, I am very happy to see your results. Thank you so much. And um, I will cr just wait for new creations from you, for new dresses. Uh, very beautiful we have from Martina. Yes, I agree. A really nice result. And uh, I feel from Yolanda, you know, she, she just uh, learned a few courses from JT House uh, together with me. And now I feel so big energy from Yolanda. She just... Uh, uh, need more time, yes, to create new and new dresses and she uh, write me messages and I feel this energy. Uh, she uh, want to create a lot of um, just designs uh, from different colors, uh, different size, different uh, uh, lengths of dresses and blouses. So it's a big uh, joy for me to have such, such results together with you. Uh, so thank you from all my heart. <laughs> I see a comment, Yolanta. It's a pleasure to learn from you, Julia. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you very much, Yolanta. But now you just create your own dresses. It's really fantastic. It's bigger level now. So <laughs> that's why I like this job. <laughs> love this job and love to crochet. A very beautiful dress from Jamie. Thank you so much, Jamie. Yeah, really fantastic. And um, just one more uh, thing. Uh, just uh, I wanted to show you today. Let me show you this one. Uh, it's interesting, yes. Maybe this will be some interesting information for you. Uh, this was uh, my story, beginning of story with Virginia. And Virginia made incredibly beautiful bracelet. Uh, and we have here golden, uh, golden beige colors, turquoise colors in two shades or three shades, white colors. And uh, she asked me to find uh, threads, yes, to join um, all these threads and uh, we will create dress uh, and uh, she want to make this dress to this bracelet and wear it together in for some event. And uh, t today I created such a composition of colors from my favorite Italian viscous and we have here um, this uh, nuts color, brown, brown, also gray, gray brown, uh, two colors, this is light uh, golden beige, this is a little bit different, golden beige, white thread, turquoise, very bright and very light. And I think uh, such dress, <laughs> I, I, I will love also when I will see the result. Also, we will talk about how to join these colors, uh, what color will be the main one, and also what parts we will made from this uh, bright, yes, colors will be accents or nuances in this dress. Uh, so, Sometimes uh, I have the same, sometimes, when I have just something like inspiration. In this case we have bracelet, sometimes we have maybe some one motif will inspire you or some color will inspire you on 
something like this. You start from one point and your imagination will create incredible design of dress or blouse or top and it's uh, this moment just catch this moment and start to create. It's really nice when you have this inspiration. So just uh, I want to share with you this information. It's a really nice idea to create a dress starting from something small and really beautiful. Thank you so much for all your uh, fantastic results. Uh, everything uh, give me more energy to create uh, these workshops, courses and also new projects. Thank you so much. Uh, I love your work. Everything looks great. Each time more and more difficult. Uh, so uh, thank you for this. Uh, now I will show you dues from our school. So about journal. Uh, we collaborate with a uh, firm and very soon this firm will, will publish our journal. Everything is okay. Uh, this is new work for me, but uh, step by step I work it and uh, together with all my team we are making this journal and very soon we will send letters to all clients, uh, to all friends and you will receive this first uh, journal, my dream, first crochet journal made by JT House Crochet School. Maybe someone new is watching this workshop. If you want to receive journal, the edition, first edition will be limited. So if you want, you can buy it. We have, we will have your journals more and uh, you will receive it. This printed journal by, uh, in letter, by, uh, by post, I'm sending by post. And uh, this will be a journal with six outer elements and uh, with colored step-by-step -step schemes, with instructions in English. This was my dream for a long time and last month I am working very hard to uh, finish this project and also uh, we are working as a second journal too about crochet project. So now you can buy this journal for $19 with free shipping and uh, in uh, just small time you will receive it from me. Uh, beautiful bracelet, love the color. Thank you Lanta, <laughs> thank you so much for this. And uh, now about a big lottery. Uh, we have new participants. I want to show you this link for lottery. If you like our crochet school, if you want to learn here, you can uh, just uh, take incredible uh, price, crochet price, and st start learning very easily with just big discounts, with uh, beautiful threads. We have 11 crochet prizes, incredible discount, so you can take a course for even a few dollars and create your first crochet dress or blouse or coat like this. It works. Let me show you what uh, prizes we have also participants. I will show you how many we have now in this moment. So you can see seven, seven participants, 11 crochet prizes, so we are waiting at least for five participants. Uh, so please support our crochet school, support this event, it will be interesting and each of you will take incredible crochet prize. Now we have Sue, Jamie, Yolanta, Elizabeth, Linda, also Cookie and Ona. Seven participants, thank you so much for that you journeyed. Um, and now about prizes, like I told you, we have 70% discount for uh, crochet course Secrets of Irish Lace. Uh, also 60% discount for um, my course about dress Martinica and about dress Angelica, evening dress. Also we have 60% discount for crochet course about Cod Spring, about new dress Lille, about dress Dream, also for, uh, is series of courses about Irish lace and um, incredible discount for threads, 60, 50 and 40% discounts for Italian viscose and also you will receive crochet journal for free and discounts for any threads in our store with uh, free journals. New journals, uh, journal, uh, journal magazine duplet or journal mod, one of my favorite journals. And uh, now you can see list of prizes and each of you will take one of prizes. So will be nice. Also a few words about our new season. From next Saturday uh, we will have uh, new workshops about uh, new laces, new motifs, but I will work a little bit different. I need uh, more time to work on my new projects, so I really want to learn something new, want to show you something new, and I know a lot of you are waiting for new material. So that's why I decided to uh, take just another, each time, another black and white uh, scheme from journal, from internet. Um, I want to show you something not so easy, yes, and uh, I will 
learn how to create such motif or such lace and at the next workshop uh, just I will tell you and I will show you everything so if this scheme will be okay everything works good I will tell you okay this scheme is nice we can work with it but I will show you different moments nuances uh, to be sure that you will create this motif but uh, if I will see that uh, during the work, when I will try to make first time this motif, everything works not good, or I don't, I, I cannot work with such graphic, I will just uh, make some yes changes in the graphic. But uh, it will stay the black and white. Just changes I will write at the top of this graphic, and I will show you this all difficult moments where we have you know, these uh, errors uh, in the graphic. So. Uh, just step by step you will learn how to create this um, element or lace and you I hope you will understand everything during the workshop and also this record of this workshop you will have chance to watch a few times anytime <laughs> yes a lot of times just in our YouTube channel and also maybe in our free crochet patterns group uh, so, um, difference will be only in uh, one moment. I will not make colored schemes because uh, to make one scheme I need two or three days. Depends of size, of our motive, of difficulty, of motive. So like this. But don't worry, you, you will know how to make this new element. And also we will have step-by-step -step photos of new elements. So like this. Starting from next Saturday we will start new season. New season I uh, decided to make uh, 12 workshops each Saturday just we will have without breaks after we will have holidays I think two weeks and again after this we will start new season so I, I hope uh, you will like this variant of learning in our workshops and we will have new motives today we have uh, the last time this motive that we have in previous workshops uh, this element uh, I call it Arcelia and uh, it's really nice and also I uh, saw this motive in dress uh, that Yolanta Masson made that we just saw and uh, this element I will show you today how to make it it has a little bit difficult, difficult nuances and I will show you uh, so for this uh, beautiful motif I used today crochet hook in size 1.75 millimeters uh, one of uh, my favorite threads uh, Garus uh, golden uh, gold yes color and uh, I will show you now also we have special offers for today I prepared uh, Sapphire Lux just want to show you this thread and I decided to make uh, today 30% discount and uh, free shipping so we have here a very beautiful yarn, Sapphire Lux, beautiful shades of turquoise, dark turquoise, grey colors and uh, this one turquoise and I don't know blue color, blue and grey, yes. So we have here 800 grams, uh, it's enough to make a evening dress and you know this Italian viscose, this Sapphire Lux thread is amazing. So I will show you this link, uh, you can buy, you can order this kit today with 30% discount and free shipping it's really a great price for only $69 you can have kit for evening dress with free shipping it's just incredible offer just for you <laughs> today and uh, now uh, I will start to show you this element uh, I see a comment sounds very exciting uh, see you hello sorry I am late it's okay see you uh, it's really okay Nice to see you today. I will check just information in my screen. Okay, so what we have now? Okay. Uh, so like this kit we have for today. Uh, next information what we have. It's about box Amelie, my unique crochet product uh, with purple colors, the most uh, beautiful colors and really um, nice uh, uh, colors to create evening dress for this year. This will be a very popular uh, color. And uh, we have here 11 cons in total because we have two cons more like a gift. 
So we have in our crochet box a flash drive with full learning material, video tutorials, text lessons, also a pattern in your size and a color it printed schemes for all lessons, kit of yarns, all necessary threads that you need to make evening dress. Everything you will see, you will uh, uh, just receive in a wooden box designed by by me, and uh, it's really nice, uh, pr uh, just gift for someone who love who love to crochet. And if someone is interesting, you can see this information in our website. I will send you this link to this purple yes box. And now we can uh, start to talk about this beautiful element Arcelia with four leaves. And uh, I made it from very very beautiful gold yarn. Beginning is very small, 14 loops to move up, just uh, to make the ring, sorry. One uh, slip stitch in the end, uh, join to the ring, one chain loop to move up, and 11 single crochet around the ring. Finish by slip stitch. After uh, we have this uh, difficult part, uh, because we will create uh, really big stitches and uh, in this part we need to know where to join next each uh, next stitch so uh, first we start from eight chain loops this chain blue one and after we have triple treble yes this is um, a big stitch was with four times yarn over we have it here after this we have five chain loops to move up and um, double treble crochet we need to join to the previous stitch in the direct point point Next we have three chain loops, treble crochet, and after second part, this red color we have here, uh, this part is much more easy to do, because we have already all points where we will insert hook. So we have three chain loops, one double crochet to the direct point here, after five chain loops, sorry, six, yeah, five, five chain loops, next double crochet, again, to the same point where we have this big stitch, and the last is six uh, chain loops and one uh, slip stitch just um, finish this middle part after we have one more single crochet to move up turn the work and move back we have light green stitches so we have uh, how many uh, seven stitches around the first chain after uh, four single crochet around next part uh, next uh, chain next we have three stitches in the middle we have three stitches like uh, three single crochet shell uh, just starting from one point and after go to the right side and uh, make all these uh, stitches uh, symmetrically the same number of stitches and finish by slip stitch join to the chain after one uh, slip stitch move up and join to the next chain loop turn the work and move back one more time uh, create almost the same number of stitches just in the top part we have three stitches starting from one point that's all next go to the other side and make all this single crochet after this all rows uh, you need to just cross some distance to have chance to start second leaf and for this we have on the graphic four slip stitches make all this uh, small uh, chains and uh, from here you can start to make the same eight chain loops uh, triple treble crochet five chain loops double treble crochet three chain loops and treble crochet this blue part and now i want to show you this beginning because uh, i i think some of you want to know how to make it in real life and i want to show you this now we have these uh, small elements, May, uh, I made them from Italian viscose, this is gold motif and this is like chocolate, brown, very, also very nice thread. So I will show you now from Sapphire Lux blue colors and I will show you now how to make it. Uh, so I already made first one, first part, and I want to show you how to continue this whole work. So I made uh, four slip stitches, and now I will make eight chain loops to start. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four times yarn over. 
uh, to make the stitch accurate just uh, make all this place all these loops uh, very close to the top of the hook uh, now we need to skip two chain loops and to the third I will insert my hook but use it uh, just insert it below two threads not one because you will stretch it too, too much just below two threads and now start to make this big stitch yarn over and now make the loop yarn over and draw through two loops yarn over and draw through next two loops and like this repeat two times more one two and now we have the last two loops finish this big stitch and this is our beginning after this we have five chain loops one two three four five Pamela Hewitt, thank you for registering in the lottery. Uh, thank you so much for that you registered. Uh, I hope uh, you will take one of prizes that you really want. And I wish you good luck. Thank you so much for this. I'm very happy. <laughs> uh, so 24th of February we will have big lottery. So don't miss this event. It will be really interesting. So... After we have here five chain loops, make three times yarn over. Uh, just place again all these yarns very close to the top of the hook. And now we need to insert a hook to the necessary point in, the, in this big stitch. Uh, I will skip one this one uh, area when we make uh, just when we draw thread through two loops one time. I will skip this area, insert hook just. To the second here this area like this below two spreads now i will start to make this big stitch just double treble crochet and uh, one more time if you uh, if you feel that you don't like this uh, distance or uh, stitch is looking not good just uh, make it one more time or even two times or three times try to make it uh, so, uh, now again, you can just uh, change the, uh, this, this point, you can take this one or this point and try to make it and you will see which variant will be okay. So, don't be sad, it's not easy to make it in one time. Uh, so, I, in this way I see that for our motive is better to use third part, so we skip one and second part. Uh, this part is, uh, where we made uh, yarn over and uh, just draw this thread through two loops. First, second, we just skip and to the third insert the hook. This this will be better for this motif. And uh, now the last part, reaching loops one, two, three. And this time we just have on the graphic treble crochet two times yarn over. And uh, now I will skip in this preview stitch only one area. And to the second I will insert hook below two threads. This time I think will be okay for our motive. Yes, it looks uh, okay. Everything is normal here. And uh, after this we will uh, start work with other side, make three chain loops. Now everything is easy, we have two points. First to this one I will make one double crochet. After symmetrically I will make five chain loops. One, two, three, four, five. And I need to look to the graphic. Yes, we have again just one uh, double crochet to this point where we have already one stitch. And the last arch, one, two, three, four, five, six chain loops and join to this point where we start this big stitch, insert and make slip stitch. Just draw spread through everything by one time. Now uh, we have here two loops more. To the next one I will make slip stitch just to move up for the next row and slip stitch I have, turn the work and I will start to work with the first big arch. Around this arch I will make uh, 7 stitches, 3, 4, 5, 6 and I think it's nice to make last stitch uh, to the stitch here that we have in previous row, just direct to this one. After we have four stitches, one, two, three, and also we can make the last stitch to the stitch of previous row. And at the top part, we have how many stitches? Let me see. 
what we have three stitches and also at the top three stitches single crochet and now at the top uh, insert hook below two threads and to this one stitch I will make three single crochet starting from one point so this uh, side we have go to the other side and make symmetrically three single crochet around the first arch one stitch to the stitch of previous row after four four stitches two three and four to the stitch of this uh, previous row and the last area we have uh, we need to make um, I think seven stitches you will see on the graphic <laughs> if I make mistakes sorry but it's not so much important now because I really want to show you this middle part is the most difficult uh, now I need to join to the same point where we start so to this chain insert the hook and make joining by a slip stitch yarn over and draw through everything by one time and now you should find the last chain and just uh, move up make one slip stitch to this one direct chain slip stitch turn the work and one more time it's really easy just to work around along this side to each stitch of previous row you need to make only one stitch till you reach to the middle point to the top point there we will make to one point three single crochet again and like this it's really nice motif just be careful with this middle part where you have all this difficult big stitches and I almost reach to the middle part and now I can see this middle stitch here I will make a three single crochet step by step and now go to the left side and just finish to make all these stitches I really hope uh, to see you next uh, Saturday because I prepared for you very difficult lace and I will show you a lot of nuances so uh, I really uh, hope you will uh, visit this workshop and watch this lesson it will be interesting and also this lace I use it for one of my evening dresses and I will share with you this uh, beautiful uh, pattern scheme and I will explain how to make this difficult lace so it will be interesting so in the end I finish and make slip stitch to the same point where we start just at the other side and uh, now uh, we need to work here again with this middle part very small center and uh, step by step by slip stitches just move on and uh, reach to the necessary point where we start third leaf and it looks like this during the work from here we can start third leaf and after we will again cross distance and uh, start to make the last one but this will be not the end of the motif uh, just after you fin finish four leaves you will start to make last row edging around uh, looks like this you can see uh, with this edging also you will join a little bit this all leaves and you will reach to such result in the end so I hope someone <laughs> sees this workshop first time and this was useful information for you and we can continue to learn how to finish this beautiful small motif. The last row we will see. Okay, let me show you my screen. And uh, now you can see the second leaf how it looks also on the photo I already uh, use a uh, steam iron for this uh, for this part just to make a nice photo a straight photo and uh, you can see here everything very clearly this middle part is really difficult but if you make it if you will make it right you will receive such uh, fantastic result looks really interesting uh, and uh, after uh, also I want to show you this a dress uh, Juliet uh, made uh, by GT House for one of fashion shows and we have in the middle this element that I used uh, Arcelia for today 
but even more I created a few more rows with using the same uh, middle part of motif yes but uh, I try to create a really big element for middle of this dress and uh, I change it colors I go from a very dark chocolate color next I take a more light colors and uh, you can see the result on this dress we have this uh, beautiful big motif uh, in the middle of this dress uh, looks really interesting and this was one of my designs uh, for a fashion show and uh, now we have uh, the, uh, these four leaves uh, together this uh, just finish it them uh, hello all sorry for my late coming uh, Barbara I'm very happy to see you but uh, please uh, just uh, visit our workshops uh, I miss you <laughs> And next uh, Saturday we start to learn new elements, uh, very difficult elements, so please uh, be careful, uh, find, ti find time for this, please. And now uh, we can see the last part. So I show you uh, here uh, these four leaves and after you finish the last one you need to move just along this first leaf, make uh, how many five slip stitches to move up. And from here we will start to make a uh, final this year step, uh, our next uh, last row. We have arches from switching loops and a single crochet between arches. Uh, you need to skip one stitch below each arch and uh, very easily uh, just, uh, work with each side. Just in the middle we have two single crochet to uh, this uh, one point, between them we have five chain loops. After again make the same number of arches at this side, stop at the same level at this 5th stitch and join to the 5th stitch to, to another yes, to the next uh, leaf. And continue to work like this the same, uh, very easy, just a very simple edging around all 4 leaves and finish by slip stitch. Cut the yarn, hide the tails, iron and uh, stretch this motif by using steam iron and you will see a uh, really incredible result. Uh, so like this element I created from very beautiful thread gold color Garus and this is viscose, 100% e viscose and uh, we have here a full scheme for our motif and also I created from a dark brown chocolate color also really nice result, I like it very soft and silky. Uh, so such element we have for today and uh, we have different colors also in this presentation. I hope you like it and you will use it for your project. Uh, this scheme and also photos you will find in our free crochet patterns group. And uh, this information will be for free, so don't worry. Also this uh, record of this workshop you will find in our YouTube channel. And uh, this all information you can find in our new free patterns group. Thank you so much for your attention. A uh, few words about uh, a journal. Uh, very soon I will send you our journal one more time. If you want to receive magazine, first magazine from our JT House Crochet School, you have a really nice chance to buy it for $19 with free shipping today. Very soon the, the cost will be $24 uh, for this journal. And I hope. Uh, you will order uh, just pre-order it now and enjoy all these new uh, schemes, outer elements. A few words about my course about Dress Martinica. This course uh, we have in English in total eight lessons and uh, first uh, four lessons about making all necessary elements for our dress. Uh, next lesson number five about making pattern for dress in your size. You just you will create uh, this pattern by uh, algorithms that you will have in the lesson. I will send you electronic pattern in your size and you will transfer it to reality. So uh, very simply. And also at the lesson number five we will create composition from all elements and uh, this all step is not difficult at all. Lesson number six about uh, connecting individual elements to continuous fabric to continue slice. Uh, this step will be very easy in this course because for this course we use outer elements really big size so all connections uh, you can create very fast and very easily. Lesson number seven about making edgings 
um, just between uh, around the neckline and around armhole lines and the last lesson number eight about incredibly beautiful fringe we will uh, just create two layers fringe after we will join it to the uh, top part of dress and uh, the last uh, final stages you will have in this lesson and you will see the result you will see the dress you will have chance to wear it and just uh, use it for some uh, important event like this so this course goes with uh, gifts, with crochet kit uh, for, for free, just free shipping. And if someone is interesting, I will send you now this link where you can find information about gifts, about everything. And you can start learning how to make such dress for yourself. And um, also don't forget about our uh, just store with yarns. Uh, you can... Uh, find a really beautiful uh, spreads in our store and we have uh, incredible uh, high quality spreads tested in practice by me I created a lot of um, just collections from such spreads I joined a lot of different colors and um, you can find turquoise, uh, gold, green colors, uh, purple uh, also this red and pink colors uh, and uh, also it viscous like this Thank you so much for uh, that you registered to the lottery. I hope to uh, see more uh, people uh, just in this uh, event. And I wish you really good luck. Maybe someone just join it now. You can register by uh, this link. We have incredible crochet prizes, 11 crochet prizes and um, fantastic discounts just for threads, for crochet courses. And it's really... A um, fantastic chance to start learning uh, in one of my courses just with a uh, fantastic discount. Also, you can uh, create this dress from threads, high quality threads. Also, you can use um, our vouchers, certificates for uh, big discounts. And you will receive crochet journals for free from our school. So like this, uh, thank you so much for your attention. I was uh, really happy to see you today. And uh, next Saturday we start new season with new crochet schemes, with new motifs, laces. For next Saturday we have very difficult big lace that I use it for one of my dresses. I hope to see you there and we will learn it together how to make it. I see one comment. Thank you, Julia, for your time. Looking forward to the next week's course. Yes, Linda, thank you so much. I hope to see you all. Um, I see a comment from Barbara, I am on re rehabilitation, I wish you really uh, good health and uh, quick rec recovery, just Barbara, uh, I hope uh, you will feel better soon. I see a comment from Denise Royal, beautiful work Yolanta, yes, I agree, so I wish you a really nice weekend, I hope to see you next time and uh, just uh, really I'm very grateful for your support. Thank you and have a nice today also, evening and day. Uh, bye bye for now and see you very soon on Facebook. See you. <laughs>